everyone, this is Petunia, the illustrator for our channel. Usually you hear my sister on our videos because I just prefer to do the illustrations, but since I was working on a comic for our new webtoon, which I hope you check out, and school is starting back up, I thought I'd do a speed draw. By the way, if you want to know anything about the programs I'm using, check out the video description. I'm not a very experienced artist, but if you have any technical questions, I'll do my very best to answer them in the comments. So I know lots of you are starting back to school soon, or maybe you already have, and we hope you all have a fantastic school year. One of the questions Pinky got asked a lot as a teacher, and that I actually asked a lot as a student, is why should I learn or even care about this stuff? And since we work together to teach biology on our channel, we really wanted to address that question. So I'm going to be honest with you all. When I was in school, it's not that I hated science or anything, but I just didn't really find much reason to study it. I did it because I had to do it, and I wanted to pass my tests. And I thought biology was done, all discovered, finished, and that I just needed to learn all the biology that was already discovered. But one thing I've learned from making videos with my sister is that science is far from done. There are discoveries happening every single day, and we need that research and discovery. There are long-standing problems and new ones that we all need to tackle. Climate change, diseases, resource depletion, species going extinct, bacteria that are becoming more and more resistant to antibiotics. It's really important to find solutions to these. Without advancing biology, there could be a day when simple things we take for granted, like having somewhere to put your trash, or taking an antibiotic when you have a bacterial infection, is a thing of the past. When we remind viewers to stay curious, we realize that's a lot easier said than done. You have to care about something to stay curious. It has to matter. You have to find a way to make it matter to you. So here's my sister for that. Hi everyone, Pinky here now. A quick thanks to you for the well wishes on the last speed draw for my new baby. We're both getting some more sleep now. And baby just started crawling two weeks ago. Exciting. I want to mention, just to bring awareness, I had a tough pregnancy. I developed the disorder preeclampsia when I was pregnant. In the United States where we live, the March of Dimes states that it's the cause of 15% of premature births. And what is kind of frustrating is there's still not a definite known cause, or causes, of this disorder. High blood pressure is typically one of several effects of the disease, and in my case, my body didn't respond to most of the medications used to try to lower the blood pressure, so baby had to come early. Both baby and I are doing okay now. My symptoms did resolve a few months after the baby was born. So why bring this up? Well, see, it's one of many human body disorders where there's not an actual cure or even a full understanding of what causes it. Yet, we are confident there will be an improved understanding of preeclampsia and a cure someday, just as there will be for many other disorders out there. We're confident there will be solutions out there because there will be people that are knowledgeable and care about biology and our planet. It means we're going to find more solutions. We mentioned in our videos just some fascinating examples like the potential of using algae as biofuel or using certain types of bacteria to break down plastics or using viruses to target harmful bacteria. Biology is full of potential solutions to problems and that makes me excited. Biology is global and creative. Finding relevance in biology doesn't mean that you have to be a biologist. Studying biology makes us all better at understanding science. Real science. Misinformation can spread like wildfire out there on the internet and social media, so we all have to get better about interpreting and communicating science. Our very recent Nature of Science video talks about the importance of credible sources and reading science papers critically. We have some helpful links in the description to explore. So if you are going through our biology learning playlist, discover that relevance in biology, the study of life. Well, that's it for the Amoeba Sisters, and we remind you to stay curious.